What's good, YouTube? Welcome to Proctor House Rock Wallace. And tonight, we got a very, very special episode, man, because we're actually going to be bringing in a new adult female um, here in the next few minutes. Um, but it's actually not going to be someone new, right? It's going to be one of our productions off of our boy Razor Timator and that female princess. Um, her name is Madame Doce Von Proctor House. I can't wait for you guys to check this girl out. So let's get it, y'all. This beautiful girl right here, man, guys. This is our girl, Desi Vom Tenenfeld. She is the mother of our 2A litter. She's actually out hanging out right now, getting some fresh air, break away from the pups. What's up, Kiva? What's up, Mama? You're such a great mama, guys. Cannot believe how great she is doing this time around with these 2A litter puppies, man. That face, guys. That lovable face. What's up, Mama? Push up on me. Push up. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I got you. All right, all right, I got you. 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 Push up. There we go. Push up on me. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Yeah, man. You got to see, man. Our mamas, our girls, all of our dogs here, but our mamas most definitely love to be loved on, man. Give them that loving. That's when you get to see that true personality. Come on, Daddy. Let's go, mama. Let's go. Let's go. But yeah, guys, super, super excited. This is actually the first time ever um, that we're actually bringing back one of our productions to the camp. As an adult, this female is extremely special. She came from our D litter, one of our very, very first litters. And that's actually the one and only litter that we had from that boy Razor Timotoy, guys. You guys know, man, we sent that boy Razor to Florida. Um, crazy, crazy producing. You guys will be able to get a taste of what he can do for you guys. He is on co-owned and he is available for stud service, guys. But yeah, we get a chance to check out one of his PVM productions. See how he's producing. Great structure. What's up, girl? Girl has excellent structure. What's up? Good color, good markings. What's up, Daddy? We almost ready to go back inside with the puppies. You almost ready? You almost ready? Better yet, Mama? I better feed you. Let's get our food ready, guys. This is our little mix right here, guys. This is my current go-to milk for puppies. I no longer use um, the Ultra 24. Um, and I will be doing a video in the future telling you guys why I actually stopped using um, Ultra 24. Or better yet, I'll give you guys a little insight. Um, Ultra 24, since we are getting a Razor daughter in, you guys know I did the breeding between Harley and Razor. And she did take and she successfully actually woke 11 puppies. It was a really, really great looking litter, big litter. Um, but unfortunately, it seems like they had an allergic reaction to the Ultra 24 or something was going on because it seems like the moment I would actually feed the puppies Ultra 24, their stomach was full and then there was no more puppy. The puppy basically died um, the following day and it was just something um, that blew my mind because you guys know we've been using Ultra 24 for the longest time. Um, but after that situation, I said, you know what? No more Ultra 24, I'm switching over to Nurse All, and we've used Nurse All, um, honestly, for the remaining puppies that we actually had in the beginning of the year for our Hulk and Tika litter, the Hulk and Desi litter, and then that Hannibal and that fel Felony litter, um, and they all did really well with the Nurse All, um, and we actually give Nurse All to our mothers as well, and you guys know, we got that good old beaver from that raw fan canine, I like to let that soak with the nurse all and some water for about 20 to 30 minutes until it gets really really soft just like this 
That way moms are gonna kill it. You wanna make sure she gets all the nutrition that she needs to be able to create that milk for these puppies. So let's go ahead and get this beaver inside of this um, bowl of kibble. Get this mixed up so we can get this girl fed because I just got a text from our shipper and they let me know that they're actually about 10 minutes out. So let's hurry up and get this out the this way. This is what we're looking like after it is all mixed up, guys. And yes, guys, I do feed a postnatal, um, but we are currently out, which is A-OK. -okay. We got more coming in tomorrow. So you guys don't see the postnatal inside of the mix right now. Let's go ahead and get this to our girl, Desi. Look at that girl. What's up, Desi? What's up, Desi? And this is the joys of having dogs, guys. The joys of having dogs. Look at that dirty window, man. It's on the outside, inside's clean. <laughs> Good girl, Desi's loving it. Good girl, almost. Good girl. What's up, Desi girl? And we knocking it back. Wait, man, we got our guys over there at MIT Transportation, man, okay. taking care of us like always. My new female right here, you guys will be able to see her tomorrow morning. Sunlight, but I definitely want to get a little video of my guys dropping her off, man. You guys need any help with shipping, these guys go all over the place, man, and they eat that road up like crazy. So make sure you can tap in with my guys, man, for sure. Yeah, yeah. All right, you guys, come here, Doce. She went to the back. <laughs> you like, hell nah, what's up, Doce? What's up, girl? No, we got Princess Peach, first spot. Hulk right here, second spot. We got our girl Dolce right here. She already took a poop. What's up, mama? What's up, big girl? We got that girl Dolce. Absolutely love this girl's structure and build. Definitely gonna have to put a couple pounds on her. Get a nice long trip from Florida. Man, I even like the rear angulation on that girl's legs, man. She's got it. This girl's gonna be all about structure, guys. All about structure, and she is a Razor Timator daughter. Razor and that girl, Princess. And then we got that Russian import, Kiva. And then we got our girl, Gemini, guys. So this is going to be, um, you guys know I like to bring in more stuff. So as of right now, let's say this is going to be um, our starting lineup for 2025. Um, obviously we got two pups. Proctor House stamp. We got an adult female Proctor House stamp. We got Kiva and Desi. Kiva and Desi are the only two dogs here um, that we did not produce now, guys. So super happy and thrilled to be at this point. Um, you guys know, like I said, I probably will be bringing in another female or two. Um, but man, we got majority of the camp holding that Proctor House name, man. And that's always been my goal from the very beginning getting very very close to it guys what's up princess peach when i tell you this girl thinks she the toughest thing out boy she swears she's super tough man let's go ahead and let our girl doce get some uh relaxation in let me get out of her face give her a little time you see as soon as i pop up she turn around and try to work her way to the back man so let me let her get her a little time we'll come back out in the morning time guys let's get it It is now the following morning. What's up, Hope? Got our girl Dolce right here. Dolce Von Proctor House. She seems to be in a lot better spirits than what she was last night. What's up, pretty mama? Look at that fronting on this girl. Most definitely got that body from her father, Razor Timator. Nice headpiece on her. Headpiece is built like her mama princess. And this is that girl princess right here, guys. So you guys can kind of get a good idea of where this girl she gets her looks from. What's up, Dote girl? You're a really good girl. 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 This girl looks awesome. Look at that chest, color. Love her nice headpiece. Still has that beautiful female face. 
even though she's got that dome on her, that head on her. Beautiful girl right here. Beautiful, beautiful female. What's up, mama? So this girl's gonna be all about structure, guys. What's up? <laughs> What's up, girl? What's up, Dolce? 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 Guys, even though I haven't had this female here since she was eight weeks old, man, I honestly am not worried at all. Even though you see she covers herself up with that ball, I'm not gonna put my hand down there. Um, just cause I'm not, not dumb, right? <laughs> but, she's a very friendly girl. Don't you, give me a paw. She go paw? Paw? Yep. Yep, good girl. Oh, really? Oh my gosh. Such a good girl. Good girl, Dolce. I cannot wait to announce who we're gonna be breeding this girl to. It's crazy, man. She's so much, she's really built like her dad, man. Heavy, heavy front end, nice wide chest. What's up, pretty girl? So we're gonna put a couple more LBs on her. She had a long trip from Florida. It took her a few days to get here, so we'll put a couple more pounds on her. I'll tell you what, man. Extremely happy with that girl, Dolce Von Proctor House. Really love that chest on her, man. Really love that chest on this girl. What's up? Man, we should have named you Princess too, girl. You look so much like your mama. <laughs> so much like your mama with your dad's structure and frame. It's absolutely insane. What's up, girl? What's up, girl? What's up, girl? And guys, this is the Litter May sister to that girl, Duchess Von Proctor House who's located at GSP Roddy's. What's up, girl? What's up, girl? What's up, girl? And we actually own her sister as well. Um, her sister is that girl, Demi Von Proctor House, who I have on co-own with my guys over there at Von Kit. Roddy's, Rottweiler, let's just say, in California. What's up, mama? What's up, girl? But yeah, man, just want to show you guys this girl. Day one, you guys will see the progress with her. Just like I showed you guys the progress with that girl, Kiba, when we first got her in. This girl, Dolce, is big too. What's up? Come here, Dolce. Dolce! Dolce! Guess I should go ahead and put these beds down. Did a deep cleaning this morning. Let's let Dolce hang out with this boy Hope, man. What's up, Hope? Come on. Come on, boy. Big boy. Yeah, she does. Oh, she... Hope. He ain't even worried about Dolce at all. Look, girl. Look at me. Look. Look. <laughs> Hope's like, man, I'm on phase, brother. She ain't in heat, man. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care, you brought me a new friend home. Nice. <laughs> That's hilarious. That is hilarious. These two actually complement each other very, very nicely. Yeah, I mean, almost identical color. Look at the markings on the rear. What's up, big boy? Complement each other nicely. Who knows, maybe that is the pairing that I would do. But nine times out of 10, I probably won't breed her to Hulk, not right away. You guys know, I'm looking to bring in a few more pieces for us to breed to this boy Hulk. Obviously she's a major asset, but I probably will breed her to, we'll see. It's gonna be one of our productions. Um, nine times out of 10, we'll run her to one of our productions. Um, and then maybe her second breeding that we do with her, we'll breed her to Hulk so that way we already have something uh, lined up to run the Hulk, as you guys see. We already got Madame, De I mean, not Madame Dolce. We already got Princess Peach right here. And then we got uh, our other Hulk daughter, Gemini Von Proctor House. What's up, big Gemini? What's up, girl? Look at the size on this girl right here, man. What's up, mama? What's up, buddy? Hey, <laughs> what's up, Dolce? What's up, big Hulk? 
Oka Doce, man. That's not a bad pairing right there. I know the blood works. The blood is going to click, guys. And that is one benefit for all of our clients that actually get puppies from us um, is that we breed very strategically. And it doesn't matter if you got a puppy for my very first litter or for my very last litter. When you run those dogs together, guys, you're going to create magic. What's up, mama? Yeah. Yeah, this Hulk and Doce, man. Yeah, Hulk and Madam Doce. It might not be a bad one right there, guys. Let me know what y'all think, man. Hulk Von Proctor House and Madam Doce, man. Who knows? This might be the one. This might be the one, guys. For round two. Well, with that being said, guys, this is going to be the end of the video. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Be sure to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and most definitely hit that bell to get notified when we do drop our videos. Also, please leave a comment in the section below. If this video helps you out in any way, shape, or form, you can also leave a comment and let us know what you guys would like us to go over in a future video. With that being said, we're out, guys.